idea of post-trib heresy steals peace from God. Let me show you that. Romans chapter 5 verse 1 says, Therefore being justified by faith, we have peace with God through our Lord Jesus Christ. Romans 14, 17. Go there. It says, For the kingdom of God is not meat and drink, but righteousness and peace and joy in the Holy Ghost. Peace and joy in the Holy Ghost. Romans 15, 13. It says, Now the God of hope fill you with all joy and peace, and believe in that you may abound in hope through the power of the Holy Ghost. 1 Corinthians 7.15 1 Corinthians 7.15 But if the unbelieving depart, let him depart. A brother or sister is not under bondage in such cases, but God hath called us to peace. 1 Corinthians 14.33 1 Corinthians 14.33 It says, but God, For God is not the author of confusion, but of peace as in all the churches of the saints. If you're saved, God has given you peace. All these verses here, God's given you peace. You know, you have peace with God. Every Pauline epistle opens up with peace from God. However, if you go into the time of Jacob's trouble, it would cause a contradiction because, let me show you, Revelation chapter six, verse four, okay? You have peace from God, but if you go into the time of Jacob's trouble, you have a contradiction because God takes peace from the earth. Revelation 6, 4. And there went out another horse that was red, and power was given to him that sat thereon to take peace from the earth, and that they should kill one another, and there was given unto him a great sword. So wait a second, you have peace with God, but if you go in at the time of Jacob's trouble, God takes away your peace. So is God a liar? Or are Christians getting taken up before this time period? You see, post rivers they make God a liar. Because God's given us peace, but if you go into the time of Jacob's trouble, God takes away your peace. It would cause a contradiction in the word of God. This is the mess that post trippers get themselves into. Do you have peace with God, or do you not have peace? Did Paul lie, or are we getting taken up before this time period? Because if Christians go into the time of Jacob's trouble, it would cause a contradiction in God's word. This is why I say that post trib heresy is satanic. It causes the word of God to become a lie. So, don't be deceived by this satanic post trib heresy. Don't be deceived. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with you all. To all the brethren, goodbye.